Hey everybody, Paper Mario Guy here, and welcome back to Play Pokemon Stadium Episode 6. Yes, it is a day late, but I'll get into that in a little bit. In the last episode, and the last couple of episodes, we went through and beat the Pika Cup. So now it is on to this cup, which I'm not even going to pronounce the name for anymore. Alright. So, rules. Uh, not really, like, it's, uh, kind of the same thing. But there's some other other little factors that they put in here. It's a little more strict on the Pokemon. Uh, blue panels as uh, qualifying Pokemon is 45. So uh, we'll go into more detail for that. Uh, it basically just takes all 150 and uh, tells you which one you can and cannot use. So yeah, let's see with six Pokemon. Uh, blah blah blah. blah. Maximum three Pokemon level total 80. So this is pretty cool. This is a little bit more. Max height is six foot eight and max weight is 44 pounds. So uh, kind of a weird restriction, but it's there. Unevolved Pokemon only, which is uh, probably the biggest thing that's new, and uh, everything else is the same. So not gonna go over that anymore. Uh, I already showed you what registration is, but again, we're not going to be registering anything. Instead, we're going to go right into battle with this uh, new cup, so let's go into rent rental. So, I have a pretty solid uh, idea of what I, who I want in my crew this time around. Uh, I want Sandshrew. Sandshrew is definitely going to be in there this time. I want Vulpix, because Vulpix is pretty good. Uh, Machop, definitely. Machop's probably going to be the most useful out of all the Pokemon, I think, this time. I think Machop is going to be the Starmie of this round. Ghastly, so, I mean, we may not have Haunter, but we got the next best thing, I believe. Uh, Coughing. It's pretty, pretty solid Pokemon. I mean, just look at this. Thunderbolt, Fire Blast, Smog, and Toxic. So, I mean, you, you do got some, you, you do have some pretty good, uh, attacks right there. And Dratini, the dreaded Dratini, the one that gave me so much problems in the last battle. So, whatever. So, this is going to be our six for this time around. And hopefully we have similar success with as little po po as possible problems. <coughs> so, as you can see, we got all, like, uh, grass type again. And that's basically the formula. I mean, it's not going to stray too far from that. So we're going to throw out Vulpix, we're going to throw out Dratini, and, uh, I say we throw out Coughing. So, pretty good start, I believe. Let's get underway with Pokemon Tournament Petit Cup. Tournament for Unevolved Pokemon. Petit Cup. I was right. I was right. Petit Cup. Wow. Alright, now I can pronounce this. Someone told me that it wasn't petite. It is petite. You just said it over the thing. But either way, regardless of pronunciations, I mean, that's not a big deal. The big deal is whether or not we can destroy like we did last time. And as you can see, my strategy is already working pretty well. And, uh, Perry is down. So, um, if you guys are wondering, uh, why... This episode's a little uh, late. Um, January 6th was a pretty tough day for me. Not as far, not as physically strainful as like maybe some of the other days have been, but as far as time goes, I was completely, completely boned. Like, another way to put it, I woke up at like 6.45, 6.30 in the morning, and I didn't get home until 11.30 at night. I was gone all day from my house. I had literally no time to record, and I had already completed the uh, the yeah the peak cup, which is where I recorded up to. And uh, I just didn't have like I didn't have another episode. So right now it's actually 12:16 a.m. in the morning, and I'm recording this episode. Trying to get a few uh, things going, so if just in case an epi like something like this happens in the next couple of days, uh, I won't have to worry about it as much. But I mean, 
I mean, today was pretty cool. I won again, so my record is now positive again. I haven't been negative the whole season, which is nice. But I've been evening out. So I was like 3-3, three and three, now I'm 4-3, and three, and all four of my wins were pinned. So, I mean, pretty cool stuff. I I mean, if you don't know anything about wrestling, then you're probably like, what the fuck is he talking about? But if you know wrestling, I mean, four pins, as all four of your wins, pretty cool. So, Pettit Cup number two, and uh, similar stuff again, I mean... Uh, we're not gonna, we're not gonna use Vulpix again, we're gonna throw out your team first, Coughing, and then Vulpix. Just, like, switch it up, I guess, but, I mean, the first couple of bat bouts, like, there's not much you can do. It's really just grass Pokemon the whole time. Oh, what a perfect... Alright. Fire Blast. Only five out of five, but it's a devastating move. Like, it's, it's really powerful. See, Bulbasaur had 60 HP, and I almost took him out in one hit, so it's, like I said, it, it's pretty good. Pretty good. Now, funny thing you should know about Leech Seed is that it's almost like Toxic or, uh, Toxic or, uh, any other move that continues for more than one thing. But really, he, like, if I hadn't killed him right there... He would have slowly but surely gained some health each time because he would have been draining my uh, uh, energy, so... Thank God we uh, finished him off pretty quickly. Now, Ditto's a pretty tricky... Uh, pretty tricky Pokemon to deal with, just because, I mean, it's you. Well, it's gonna be you, as you'll see in a second. Thunder! There we go. Bring in the Thunder. See, look. Oh! Bulbasaur didn't get it, obviously, because he's done, but, I mean, I'm still losing health. So that's not really that good, but whatever. Whatever. I say that a lot, whatever. Thunder Wave, awesome. Oh, but it didn't do much. And, and, and that's another... Oh, wait, 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 I keep on zoning out here for a second. I'll take a drink real quick. Uh, yeah, um, not only when Ditto, uh, like, transforms into you, does he, like, gain, like, all your moves, but he also gains all your resistance and your weaknesses, so, alright, this is bullshit, I hate rap, oh my god, I'm just gonna switch the whole picks. The hello, Vulpix. Alright, so I got some drink into me, which is nice. We're gonna dig, just because, I mean, that's pretty much guaranteed to kill him, or at least do a significant amount of damage, so. Ah! Oh, January 7th. What was I talking about in the end of the last video? I think I was talking about this and those, uh, Pokemon. But what, um, I haven't talked about it since. Uh, watch final episodes of uh, Mega Man X, like stats wise and shit like that. But in Avatar, if you guys haven't uh, like been up to date with some of this stuff, Avatar is doing incredibly good. It's actually pretty scary how good Avatar is doing in the movies right now. Worldwide, it has over a billion dollars made. Like, there's only like five five uh, movies in the entire like like of all time that have grossed over five. Or over a billion dollars worldwide, so I mean, it's a pretty significant number. Alright, we're gonna switch the coffin. I fucking hate rap. Ugh. Ugh. Uh, but, um. Uh, Coughing kind of reminds me of like a fat kid in this game. Like, just like fat kid stuffing his face with like cake and like pie and shit. But to all you fat people out there watching, I do not discriminate against fat people, don't worry. Although, I do discriminate against fat people who complain about being fat 
but doesn't do anything about it, and then use the excuse that they were born that way. Because, I mean, honestly, if you're overweight or you have an issue with your weight and you just, like, use the excuse that you were born that way, like, go shave your balls with a cheese grater. Because that's just absolutely ridiculous. You're born that way. Bullshit. You're born with fucking, like... Wait. Oh, getting... Yeah, you're born with, like, diseases, and born with shit like cancer and other family illnesses, so don't give me that health bullshit. But anyway, um, I'm Paper Mario Guy, and I'll see you in the next episode. See you later.